Bruce, they're smaller. So I think for him is keep it simple, a couple dribbles, mm -hmm. bang some bodies, pump fake, and get into that free throw line and play, I wouldn't even say downhill, catch it downhill and then play toward the basket. Boston was such a good three-point shooting team throughout the course of the regular season. And if you were listening to the end of the broadcast, Stan Van Gundy brought it up, the number, it's outstanding. It's clear as day. When the Celtics make 13 or more threes during this postseason run, they are now 9-2. and two. They are 2-9 and nine when they make 10 or less threes. Smitty, let's go through these threes that they made tonight because this really, it shows you, they're not living and dying by the three, but they're a team that needs to get good quality looks and they need to go in. Uh, Jerry, you said it the best. It's quality looks. And that's the one thing about the Boston Celtics is how they're getting their three-point shots. And let's watch this one. You can see the pick and roll from Smart. He slips it. And then there's two. I love how he got off the basketball, and then you got some guys knocking down shots. But for me, is they had people moving. It was quick. It was crisp. And yeah, he draw two, any big-time player, once you draw two, somebody's got to be open, and then guys are running at you. And the hardest defense to me, Booze, has always been closeout because you don't know what to do, especially if a guy can shoot it. Now, you guys, you can see right here, you showing they're moving the basketball. These are just good rhythm shots. You, if you take a lot of contested shots, you're not going to shoot a high percentage. But if you take some open threes like they were getting, it made life great. And I love getting the two, drawing it. These are just shoot-around shots, I call them booze, versus contested threes. Contested threes is the hardest thing to do. 28 assists on 43 made field goals. Again, we're waiting for the coaches to come to the podium. We'll bring you that live from both Coach Missoula, We'd imagine it'll be a lot less contentious press conference than the first three games with the media. We'll also hear from Eric Spolstra. We expect to hear from Jason Tatum, Jalen Brown, and several other players. Um, Jalen Brown said, don't let us win tonight. That was his quote at shoot-around earlier today. What Smitty just broke down for us, Booz, is that repeatable? Can they do that again, not three more times? Can they do it one more time at least to continue this series? Yeah, it's one game at a time. I think they have to. I mean, they're a much better team when they're, they're making quality shots, as Smitty said, moving the ball with, with energy, making the extra pass, drawing two, kicking it to the open man. They started out in the paint, but they got hot from around the perimeter. And then they translated to great defense. They, they held the Miami Heat to 25% from the three-point line, under 44% for the game. That also propelled them to win. They turned their defense, as you see right here in the offense, did a great job of contesting Miami Heat's three-point shots. You saw Duncan Robinson's shot get blocked multiple times. That led the offense on the other end. So the Heat, a couple of big numbers tonight for them. They were so good shooting the ball throughout the first three games of this series. That kind of flipped, and right? And this is a team that was not a good, not just not a, above average. They were a terrible three-point shooting team throughout the course of the season. They weren't very good from three against the Knicks. They found other ways to win. But tonight, 8 of 32 from three-point territory. The, the Celtics go 19 of 45. And then the other issue in this series, Smitty, had been turnovers. The Celtics got careless, particularly in those crunch time moments in game one and two. Tonight, just 10 total turnovers, and they forced 16 turnovers for Miami and turned that into 27 points. And, you know, the Miami Heat have not been turning the basketball.